Greetings, Dance Daniels here. This is my uh, effort to get base forms to work. And I want to thank Mr. Jensen for his response to my question. Um, using a spreadsheet as a data source for base is uh, not allowed. So I'm going to create a CSV, which is technically, I hope, not a spreadsheet <coughs> as far as OpenOffice is concerned. So uh, let's create some, um, let's create a basic. CSV file, um, one, let's see if A and November works. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the fill down uh, yeah, let me see if I can use insert file ah. cancel all right, so edit, fill, oh, look at that, won't allow me to do it. Okay, so I'll do that and see if it works. Edit, fill, down, oh, look at that, not what I wanted. Edit, I want it to be a series, so now I'll change that, down, uh, linear, and increment is one. Let's see if that works. Yes, okay, it works. Now we'll do, I'll dump this, uh, delete, and now we'll do the same thing here. Ah, why? Holding down the shift key, now it works. Okay, edit, fill, series. Let's see if it handles the A. Start value, linear, growth. Let's try that. Start value. Doesn't like A, so what about formulas? No, linear. Didn't like that. <coughs> oh, let's we'll start with date. How's that? And start value, um, one January. Didn't like that. Um, so we'll go with month Jan. Ah! How annoying is that? January. <sighs> Start value January. Doesn't like it. Why not? Oh man, the fill series in OpenOffice is just not. It's not open. It's not. I'll say it. It's not. It's not Excel. Let's see if that works. No. Okay, doesn't like that. Doesn't like that. What a pain. <laughs> January, I believe, is a valid date. <sighs> Cancel. Um, all right, so I have to type this. January, Feb, March. It's not smart enough to see that I'm actually putting in a series of months. Let's insert. Okay. So I'm making this really simple because this is just not easy. Get rid of this. Delete columns. So here is my here is my very basic CSV. Okay, so file, save as. Desktop test.csv. Keeping current format, click OK. All right, now, fine. Let's go file. Now we're going to go to a new database. New database. 
Uh, choose an existing database. I'm going to use the text and not the spreadsheet, which apparently OpenOffice doesn't allow. That's OK. Path to text files. Desktop. Oh, look at that. OK, that doesn't work. Path to text files. Not right there. Browse. Desktop. Oh, look at that. Still is not working. It's not allowing me to pull up. Why? Path to text files, CSV. Desktop. CSV, it's not seeing it. Why is it not seeing it? Oh man, I just tell you, open office sometimes. <sighs> Why is it not seeing it? Next, maybe it'll find it on its own. Finish. All right, save. Well, oh, look at that. Now it sees it. All right, so I'm going to create a form. Use a wizard to create a form. I've done this so many times before. It's almost got it by memory. By memory. Okay, right, because I didn't. Right. So it's not giving me lock on it because I'm still opened. Cancel. Is it still open? I guess that's why it's complaining. It should say that it doesn't like when it's open. All right, so um, here are my tables. Yes, okay. Test is the one I'm going to use. Right clicking doesn't do. Okay, so there's there's my data. I have a primary ID. And now let's go to form. Use wizard to create a form. Right, right. So what is it going to give me any other option? No. I have to go to that one. Uh, select all, move, next, next. Next, next, next. Finish. Read only again. A CSV file is read only. Why? How does OpenOffice plan on people getting data into it if it doesn't allow read only, if it doesn't allow CSV or spreadsheets? I am so confused. <sighs> Thanks for watching and OpenOffice people make some videos on how to use OpenOffice Base. This is ridiculous.